What's going on guys, Casual Savage here, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to disappear like this. And I'm right back. So uh, it's a pretty simple effect, and let's get to it. Okay, so for this, this is what you'll need to record. Have your camera on a tripod like I did, and then you just want to have the background where you're not in it. Then what you want to do is make sure this is at the best and full, and you want to take a snapshot and just save this to your desktop. And this is going to be our background image. The next thing you can do is trim everything down to the part where you do everything. So I'm actually editing the video you saw at the start of this video. As you can see, for me, I just went like that. Uh, of course, you can do any emotion you want. You can just stand there or sit there and disappear with the smoke. But for me, I just did a click. So I'm just going to play through to find it like this. And then I'm going to press S on my keyboard and I'm going to trim this down until I start talking again, which is up here. So now what we're going to do is add on that image we took the screenshot of, drag and drop it here, and make sure it's on a new video track, and we're simply going to extend this out across the bottom. And this is going to be a still image. Now we need the green screen, a download link this will be in the description. I'm going to drag and drop this into Vegas. And now you want to make sure this is dragged above your video. And then we need to trim it down because as you can see it doesn't start straight away. Okay, so I found the part where the explosion or the smoke happens and it's right here, so it comes up. And then it just goes away like that. Now, in the video you saw at the start, I actually sped it up and I also made it bigger. And we're going to do that again now. So I've just trimmed it down to the part where the explosion happens and the smoke goes off screen. And now what I'm going to do is take off this green screen. So the way we do that, we're going to head over to video effects. If you don't see it, then come to view, windows layout and select default layout. And then from video effects, you're going to come down to chroma key and we can drag on the pure green screen, drag and drop it. And now we also want to turn up the low threshold and the reason for this as you'll see if I turn this up our image becomes brighter and that's because um, the smoke overlay actually darkened our video so bring that up a bit and I'm gonna keep mine there I'm gonna X out of this and the next thing we need to do we need to position this in the correct part so for example my action was a click of the fingers so if I find that which is right there that is where I want the smoke or most of the smoke to be covering the screen. So we're going to drag back the green screen and it's right here. And now what we're going to do, we're going to come to the track motion. Now make sure sync cursor is unchecked and then simply make this bigger. And the way I made it bigger, I made it bigger to the part where all of my uh, body was covered like so. So then it doesn't look like I just disappear. And it'll be really obvious if you don't cover it up, so make sure you try and cover all of yourself up. We want this keyframe at the start, so we can just drag it there before this. And now if I play this through, like this. I sort of disappeared as you can see, so that didn't work. So that is because we need to trim the video down, so when this is all up in the air, right here, we're going to trim this video down where I'm talking. Now yes, my click is right here. So. If I just play this through very quickly, I want you to listen out for the audio and there's going to be something wrong. I'm showing you how to disappear like this. The click didn't last the entire time it should, so it makes it obvious that it was cut off. So if that's the case, we're going to press U on our keyboard to separate the video from the audio. I'm simply going to drag the audio across a bit more, like that. So now I'm going to play this through again. And like this. And just like that, it looks better. So the next part on the part where I said I sped it up, and this is where I'm going to speed it up now. So I'm going to play through it. This. So from here, I'm going to speed it up. So I'm going to press S on my keyboard to split it. And then I'm going to hold control and drag it the ends in. So it'll look like this. This. Now, yes, it looks pretty fast. So I'm going to take it out a bit more. This. There we go, and now we can trim this down. And of course, uh, what I done, I flicked myself back in. So we need to do the exact same steps again, but this time we can just press Control C and copy these two. And then we're gonna press Control V to paste them in. And now I'm gonna find the click where I do it, which is right here. And we also need to make sure the explosion is right on top, which is right here. So then I'm gonna trim this to this part. And now if I play this through from here, and I'm right back, it looks a bit better, and I'm right back. 
So uh, it's a pretty simple effect, and the that is how simple it is to create that smoke uh, disappear effect. As you can see, it's really simple. Um, just a green screen. And like I mentioned, a download to this green screen will be in the description. It'll be on Mediafire and Mega as always. But that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, rate, and uh, peace.